Have you guys completely forgot about what promo usually drops in the middle of January every year in Madden? Not counting last year though, but it, that's right. I'm talking about the Team of the Year promo. Team of the Year normally tends to drop in the middle of January and it usually is one of the best promos out there because every single team, not team, but every position gets a really good card. You probably forgot all about it, but if you do all your Team of the Week solo challenges, you're going to be able to get yourself a free Team of the Year card. And I'm probably not just you guys, but probably a lot of you guys have totally forgot about it and have not been catching up on your Team of the Week solo. So I just wanted to let you guys know, don't forget to do your Team of the Week solo. You should probably be doing them every week now, especially since the Madden season is about over. Not the Madden season, but the NFL season. We only got about four weeks left before it's officially over. And you guys can go ahead and do those solo challenges. Once you do all each section of the solo challenge, you're gonna be rewarded with a collectible, which I'm gonna show you guys right on the screen. Just give it a couple seconds, and it's right there. The team of the year token. This is the token I'm talking about. As you guys can see here, collect 17 of these collectibles and exchange them for a champion team of the year player when team of the year drops. And if I'm not mistaken, last year when we swapped all our tokens, we were able to choose who we want and it was tradable and you could, not tradable, auctionable. And you guys, you guys get the idea. It was auctionable and you guys can make a lot of coins, a lot of coins. I think it was like 500k, 600k last year, but it's a good way to make yourself some free coins. So I highly recommend if you guys do not go ahead and catch up on your team of the week solo challenge because they give you some nice solid packs, but they're like mad packs, BND packs, whatever you want to call them. Pretty shitty packs, but still, it's some free packs right there. So free cards you guys can get on your teams. So I highly recommend you guys don't fall behind, go out there catch up on those solo challenges because like me I'm really behind I totally forgot about it usually it happens when you guys take a break of the game take a couple breaks because the game just is not enjoyable and yeah so just want to let you guys know last chance just don't forget to do those two new solo challenge challenges I recommend doing them right now so you guys don't forget so hope you guys enjoy hope you guys did enjoy the video make sure to hit the like button and subscribe down below that was a, that was it for today's video see you guys next time